Hi, it's Roxanne Karn, personal stylist here, and I'm gonna talk to you today about how to take care of your brand new shoes from day one. So when you get a new pair of shoes, immediately you wanna start wearing them. I mean, that's the whole point, right? That's why we get our new shoes, but if you want to extend the life of your new shoe, what I highly recommend is going to a cobbler and having them put a sole protector on immediately. So whenever I get new shoes, uh, and here's an example of some of my favorite Sam Edelman pumps, my Python pumps, um, I immediately take them to the cobbler and get a sole just installed on the bottom of it. And this really does extend the life of your shoe because you're not wearing down any of the natural sole that came uh, with the brand new shoe. And I think too, it's really important as you keep up with the maintenance of your shoe from season to season, especially if you have ones that you wear frequently, that you can go ahead and get them resold. Again, is going to make just such an impact on how long you have your shoe. And then also having the cobbler also update and install the heel tips as well because those get worn actually the fastest. So when you get your shoe uh, sole installed, depending on the type of shoe, they've got different types. And depending on the cobbler, they may have different colors too. So for most pumps or most shoes, I get kind of the standard black, but you can get a black one, a black sole that actually has some grip on it. And that is so, so important. I don't know if any of you have had brand new shoes, especially pumps that are really slick on the bottom and you need some type of grip. So the sole protector does double duty. It protects your shoe, but it also adds that added traction. So you're just, you know, your foot doesn't just give out underneath you. So this is one example of a sole that I had installed. And this is actually the original sole. And I've had these shoes for probably about, I would say like four years now, and I haven't had to get them replaced yet. Just the heel tip, but not the sole. So you see, it works. I wanna show you another shoe this is another um i'm a pump girl i love my pumps what can i say but here is an example of one of my valentino pumps and the with the luxury shoe with some cobblers what they'll do is that they'll put a sole on that actually match it matches the color of the sole of the shoe so in this instance we've got this beautiful beige so the cobbler put on this um, sole protector that is really, it's an interesting texture. It's almost rubbery, but it's the same color. And uh, when he offered that to me, I was like, fantastic. You know, no one is really gonna see the very bottom of your shoe, but there is something to be said about having it just maintain and be one color all throughout. So I really, really like that option. And you should talk to your cobbler and see if they offer that as well. And I'll show you one more pump. And that is my black Louboutin pump. So the Louboutin shoes are well known for the red bottom, right? And um, like I said, the cobbler that I go to, they do offer that same beautiful kind of cherry red color. And that's that grip that goes right on the bottom of the shoe. And earlier I mentioned shoes being extremely slick, some of them being really slick. Red bottoms are known for that. I will not wear a red bottom unless it has a sole protector because it is so, so, so smooth. And depending on the surface you're, wa you're walking on, you could very, very easily slip. So make sure that you get a sole protector on your red bottoms. And if you can, get a red one that matches too. So that's my tip for you in terms of starting your shoe off on the right foot pun intended, and extending the life of your brand new shoes. I hope that's helpful. And if you like this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and drop a comment on the bottom to let me know if you also do the same thing, if you get brand new sole protectors installed on your favorite shoes as soon as you buy them. Thanks so much for watching, and here's to Sensible Style.